Hi Scorpio, Daily Horoscope for June 19, 2023. Something very powerful is happening in the sky today. It won't be easy, but if you give it time and let it grow into all it can be, it will be something really great. Today's new moon is in Gemini, which is in your strong 8th house of shared finances and large sums of money. Since this house is about big money, it won't affect your daily income the way a raise might. Instead, this house is more worried about things like taxes, inheritances, bonuses, and other large sums of money. This part of your chart is without a doubt the most intense, so this transit might feel a little hard as you deal with the more serious parts of the 8th house. It's likely that someone close to you will be involved in any money issues that come up, but with the stars aligning in your favor, you should be sitting on a nice sum by the time the full moon that corresponds to this part of your chart comes around in 6 months. Does your relationship with someone give your life meaning? Does it make you feel spiritually connected to something you believe in that is bigger than you? Today, when the moon is in Cancer and in your ninth house, these are good things to think about. It's so beautiful to feel like your bond with your partner goes beyond a physical, emotional, or even thinking level. Having a sense of holiness in your relationship makes it so much more fulfilling on so many levels. It's important to make sure that the people you choose to spend your time with share your values. This doesn't mean you have to have the same ideas about life or agree on everything, but when you can build a life with your partner that is based on your core values, it makes the relationship more important and likely to last longer. Also, think about how you can broaden your views by being open to the different ideas your partner brings up. Do you feel like your job has a spiritual connection for you? Today, when the moon is in Cancer and in your ninth house, this is a good thing to think about. What can you do to get more out of what you do? Larger in the sense that it ties you to something bigger than you, something you believe in and have trust in. By doing this, you can get so much more satisfaction and value out of your job. So many people are unhappy with what they do because they keep their spiritual lives and work lives separate. True faith is living a life in which the holy is expressed in everything you do, including your job. Scorpio this moon energy wants you to think carefully about your finances and how thoughts from the past might be holding you back from reaching your full potential. You've had your share of problems, but you're ready to move on with a positive attitude and a new faith in yourself. There are opportunities to make more money coming up, but first you need to make a plan. You can save money by making changes to how you spend your own money. Check what you get and what you spend. Check to see what you can change. You'll be amazed at how much money you can save. Scorpio, the days ahead will be full of shocks for you. Today, Scorpio, a new moon makes it easier for you to get what you want. Try to be thankful for the things you already have. Being grateful will raise your emotions and make you feel more excited about life right now. Appetite is a stone that makes you more excited about life and makes you feel more grateful for the world and the people in it. Carry a piece of appetite with you today to help you feel amazed by the world. Potatoes have a lot of vitamin C, iron, and other good things. Scorpio, today would be a great time for oven fries or a baked potato with sour cream and nutritional yeast. Things are about to get very serious, so you might as well put up the do not disturb sign and change into something more comfy. Today's beautiful new moon in Gemini shines a light on your 8th house of sex and closeness making it easier for you to give your sex life a new shot of, well, life. Start making new physical and mental attempts to connect with yourself over the next two weeks, and do everything you can to get your mind in line with what you want. We tend to bury a lot of parts of ourselves, especially our greatest wishes, but now is the time to dig them up and give them room to grow. If you let free, I bet you'll get some really cool things back. I wish you a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.